everyone and welcome back to my next installment of Wolfenstein the Old Blood. I am your host, the Mad Hatter. And what we're doing is right now, um, we're waiting on this uh, soldier to come by here. And I'm trying not to also be seen by him because he'll call everybody their grandmother in a dog spot. So patience is key. Uh, in a lot of these missions, in ladder missions, rather. This is not a time to just be going gung-ho. And then, see, I was almost caught right there, but once he gets to this point right there, knock him out, and there he goes. It's just that simple. And it's really cool, because, um... What I tried to do this before, and I failed at it, and I didn't want... I'm not going to go and leave that on the video there but hey we're all human we're gonna make mistakes here and there now the one mistake I did make and I left this part in it didn't get me killed or anything um, however uh, I wanted to share this part with you um, this guard that's coming up the pipe right here you gotta you gotta time it really just right so the second he turns around you want to you want to actually get right behind him and then take him out. Like, I waited too long right here, and that's it. Right there. I took too long on that. However, um, and they saw. But if you can get, if, if you can kill him before he gets close to, uh, close enough to that doorway, they won't see uh, anything and they won't start coming at you. Not that this was a problem at all. I mean, I'm just saying... I mean, I have seen it done where they where they have done that. Um, I don't remember the videos off the top of my head. And I don't have time to really find them because it's getting late. And I, I want to get this video out to you guys. Despite all the problems I've been having, I'm, I'm wanting to get these out to you guys. Because, I mean, this is a labor of love for me right here. So, I'll be honest with you guys. So now, what we're going to do... Just try our best not to get shot. Now the funny thing with the sh with the machine guns at range, they really don't do much damage. Um, however, um, staying at a distance when they're firing at you is always going to be to your advantage. So you really want to. Um, keep that in mind now there's now as I said I played this through before so there's gonna be a sniper coming up in here so you want to you want to stay at range but also you don't want to get hit by him either but you want to be able to have a clean shot there we go he's right there you can see you can even see the the vapor trails the bullet goes by line him up take him out done What's that? Kill as many Nazis as I can? No, I said... Can't hear you, Kessler. Lots of static. Now, one of the things you want to do when you come in here is go over here to the, to the right. Take this guy out. Now there's one more coming in at you, so he's gonna throw a grenade. Come on down here, and just throw one back at him. This strategy worked for me at least. And then that went off, and then that took out the last dude in here. Now one of the things I also did is uh, search around the whole place, pick up whatever armor and ammunition that I need before going out that window you see there to the left. Now. You want to make sure you do this because once you exit out the window, you can't get back in. Um, it's a theme with a lot of the, a lot of the levels, and I and I understand why. So, grab everything you can, and get out of dodge. I'm gonna grab this shotgun ammo over here. Let's see, grab the. 
Grab that, awesome. Grab the knife. Top off. And grab all this. And nope, okay. Well then. Looks like we are heading outside. Now my personal preference, like if I enter a new whenever I enter any new area is to have my silenced pistol and my machine gun. Now when you jump out the window, you're gonna go out and to the right. You're gonna come down here, go down the ramp, and onto this, onto this uh, landing over here. Now, what you want to do first before going anywhere is knock out the soldier there. With your silence pistol. Now, timing these super soldiers are key. So you want to go and you want to time it. Second he turns around, run, jump, and get yourself up the ladder real quick. Now you can use the ladder on the opposite side, but I chose this one. Um, well, it was just random, and it was the closest one to me at the time, to be totally honest. Uh, let's see. No. Ah, oh, here we go. Now one of my biggest fears is like these guys seeing me through here. And, they actually did when I poked out, out of the window, so you gotta really be careful. They're... They're line of sight. Now, there goes the first Commandant. Like I said, I tried this before, and, and um, I had failed at it, so I had to try it over again, so I'm not gonna lie. Um, now, originally I thought that the uh, other Commandant would come down into that other area right there. But unfortunately, he doesn't. So what you gotta do is you gotta jump up. And you gotta try to stay out of their sight, but try to keep the commandant in sight. I've always had a problem with uh, shooting at a moving target, because even if you do get a shot off and it stuns them, for so good reason, I cannot get that. I can't do it. So what I did was, uh, I'll tell you about that truck in a second. Uh, I went and said, okay, I'm not gonna have the angle on him right here. So I ran over to this other window and I, I, ma I did manage to actually get the angle on him. And right there he was and took him down. Now that truck that we saw here at the bottom, um, this one right here. Now there's another, there's one way you could do it. You can wait for them to pass by to where you could jump in the truck and then just pe and then take out both super soldiers with the with the turret that's there. However, there's a, uh, there's a uh, a better op uh, well yeah a better option. I was going to use opportunity for lack of a better word. And that's create your own zip line. When you get down over here, you want to get down and stay up against the wall right over here or as close to it. So this way you're out of their line of sight. Pick up this right here so you have the extra ammo and you are home free no muss no fuss and um, I do have a video where I actually went and I'll, I'll post it another time drunken bastard nothing worse than an angry drunk anyway Schmidt the Baker shop Kessler. I'll tell you all in a minute. Found Agent Two's house. Dinar sits and singing in moonshine. Open the gate to the side of the building. There's a key underneath a large rock. Use the basement window. Where's your shirt, you handsome sod? Pippa, you're agent too. It's Nurse Inga now. Cute Rest nurse. your feet for a moment. Have some tea and biscuits. So this is where they transferred you? Yeah, six months now. 
Haven't seen you since the London HQ party. Oh, that was a riot. Wesley spilled beer all over my Bristol's. <laughs> Clumsy twit. I, uh, mm -hmm. I tried to save him, Pippa. I know you did, love. I'm sorry. This is not the time for maudlin stories. Listen, I know what you're after, Blasco. The man in my bed over there is one of Helga's Nazi flunkies. Before he took a little nap, I loosened his tongue. The folder you're searching for is located in Helga's room at the Wolfberg Tavern. Now, apparently, she's quite the wine connoisseur. Pose as a waiter, and maybe you can get close to her. But for God's sake, put some bloody clothes on first. There's a shirt in the chest over there. Bastard. Do leave your guns. The tavern staff don't carry firearms. I'll keep them safe for you. Fucking Nazis. And people just follow these bergs like brainless ghouls. Maybe they deserve nothing better. The question is, where is he hiding all this? Is he just carrying it on his back? On his hip? Right. <laughs> One thing I didn't this think about... Listed. Or try, Come or try, with this try it, just to see. If you go up to a Nazi in the bed, you just shoot him with your, uh, with your, um, hand, the tunnel your hand is a 9.4 meter swim to the well in the tavern's uh, backyard. Before putting your stuff into the Return trunk. to me once you've obtained help. I'm Helga's wondering if that would save Pip in the long run. Don't you fucking or he might just come now. back to life you anyway. I, I don't know, I just thought it would be kind of an idea. Don't rest till I get back. Now we're gonna climb up here, crazy climber style. Here we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> now we got two dogs up here. One over here in front of us, and then one over to the far left. So what we're going to do is we're going to quietly come up on them, and we're going to take them out. I was just so afraid of, like, having these guys come at me, because I, I actually failed at this one. I just came around the corner and didn't realize they were even there. I was like, oh, crap. Then we got the guy over here. And it's really, I mean, I've, I've not had any problems as, like, as far as, like, killing these guys, like, if I, if I do it right, stealthing. But many of the time where I'll not pay attention and I'll be attacked by one of them. And they can, they can take down your health and armor in, like, less than two seconds. Trust me on that. You don't want to mess around there. Spent it all on rock candy. Sweet, sweet candy. Yeah. One of the things I, I was doing is I went to look around, see if there's anything like any letters, any papers or whatnot that I would need. Um, obviously, it's Oktoberfest because I got the posters up. Grab this. a lively group. Rudolf meint, dass ihr heute den Weg hinein öffnen geht. Das ging aber schnell. Ich weiß, die Ausgaben sind sehr gut gelaufen. So let's see. Now we got bring this over to Hey, Oberst. Oberst, 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 
So, spricht man das aus. Genug jetzt von diesem Quatsch, Helga. One of the first things I did was, and I didn't, and I made the mistake of not grabbing this the first time. Was to grab that. Nicht zufrieden. Ach, halten Sie doch die Schnauze, Sie Jammerlappen. Wie bitte? Right Schicken Sie ihn weg, damit wir unser Gespräch this. fortsetzen können. Ach, Schreiner, verdammt nochmal. Jetzt lassen Sie mich doch erstmal meinen Bein genießen. Generalstraße will Ergebnisse sehen. Ich bringe Sie zur Ausgrabung, dann werden Sie schon sehen. Um, Warten Sie. Fuck. Setzen Now, Sie sich. You're like, oh, okay. Wie heißen Sie? Um, Franz. Franz? Mein Cousin ist auch so. Fasziniert Sie das, Franz? Als Kind habe ich meine eigenen Karten gezeichnet und im Wald bei uns zu Hause nach Schätzen gegraben. <lacht> ja, so konnte ich allein sein. Und dann bekam ich auf einmal Polio. Ich war Monate ans Bett gefesselt, hatte schreckliche Träume. Und dann starb mein Bein ab. Habe ich deswegen geheult? Aber natürlich. Ist ja normal. Aber aufgeben ist was für Schwächlinge. Ich habe nie aufgegeben. Ich habe mein Schicksal in die Hand genommen. Haben Sie Ihr Schicksal in der Hand, Friends? Nur zu. Probieren Sie den Wein für mich. Los. Probieren Sie. See here. I was reluctant to do this, but I actually wanted to see what would happen, but I was afraid. Und? Und sie schüttelt. Köstlich. Sie haben einen interessanten Akzent. <lacht> Köstlich. Das ist der erbärmlichste Wein, den ich je getrunken habe. Der ist sauer, um Gottes Willen. Trinken Sie aus. Ja, alles. Trinken Sie. Man riecht es sofort. Wie feuchter Keller. Muffig. Ein Hauch von Rosine. Süß wie Portwein. Ein Rotwein sollte nicht nach Port schmecken. So was würde ich nicht mal meinem ärgsten Feind vorsetzen. Helga! Warum verschwenden Sie Ihre Zeit mit diesem Banausen? Because, my dear, incompetent Schreiner, he's not a waiter. He's a spy! Do you really think I would be impressed by your atrocious German? Now give me the folder, Franz! Oh. Behalten Sie ihn im Auge. Was ist los, Eberhard? Wir haben Dynamit eingesetzt, um ein Loch in die Gruft zu sprengen. Da kommt etwas raus. Eberhard, unternehmen Sie nicht! Alright, here's the quick time event. You gotta do this when it comes up, otherwise he will shoot you in the face. Now, to say the least, this was the fun part. Sie haben den Boden mit Dynamit gesprengt. Das muss das Erdbeben ausgelöst haben. Gott. Diese Stadt. Raus! Schnell, bevor das ganze Gebäude einstürzt. Wir müssen zur Ausgrabungsstätte. Wait till you see what the rest of this place looks like. Looks like a dusty old map. What secrets are you looking for, Helga?
Kessler, can you hear me? Helga's gone. Took the folder with her. I'm coming back to the boathouse now. Do you copy? Now we're gonna bust through this wall. We're gonna go through, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up. Now I did a little searching around here for armor and uh, health. So this way we had, I mean, I was pretty much also ammo. It's like, now I wanted to see if there was a way further back, but unfortunately there wasn't. So I went over this way, grabbed the health, and I came back over this way again, because I, I don't know why I went back there again, but it went down here, and what you want to do is want to come back over. Jesus Christ! And yes, ladies and gentlemen, it is Zombie Nazis! Which is actually another great game, Zombie Nazis. Uh, I forget the full name of it, but there's this other game called Zombie Nazis, I believe that's the correct name. And it looks pretty cool. It's like... It's available on the PlayStation Network, I know that. I'm not very sure about uh, any of the other systems out there, console systems. systems. Oh, consoles, sorry. Now here, it's best to keep the pipe together and clock it with the pipe like that than to keep them in the two separate halves. You can just bust their heads open and it just makes for an easier time. But I thought it was really cool. I mean, I had fun. This part was actually, like, for me, it, it was, like, this really awesome part of the story. So, and let's see. Is that one just helped me out? It I was really kind of hoping the taps were working. I just went and grabbed one last drink before leaving. But, hey. That's what I really want to do. I want to like, actually go to Germany, find like one of the best pubs in Germany. In all in all of Germany and just like sit there and have a couple of beers. And just sit, just to say that I went to Germany, had some beer, you know, and whatnot, and just you know, I, I've been just like finally say been there, done that as far as that's concerned. That's like my dream right there, to actually just to go there and you know, and just, you know, taking not only the culture, but it, you know, it's food and drink and all that, and just be cool. At any rate, getting back to this. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to knock these guys out with the pipe. Two hits with the pipe, and they, and they go down. And you want to try to actually use the pipe a lot as opposed to using your ammo. But Kessler, come in. You read? There's times where I... Fucking gadgets. There's times where I will just... Um, I'll keep... I'll just end up using my machine gun. I don't know why. Although I will in, in the... Uh, I don't know why I didn't grab that. I, I Originally, when I, when, I, when I first was playing through it, I, I, I thought it was maxed out, so I just said the heck with it. So I wasn't paying attention. Pip up behind you. Like I said, I don't know if, if before you put your, your, your guns into the, into the case, if you shoot that Nazi first, if, she's, if it saves her, I'm not sure. And I'll have to check you deserved a better fate than this weekend and see, because I got I got a pretty messed up schedule for this weekend. Like right here. See, I work on top of this, so I'm trying to balance doing this and and my job. So. 
At any rate, we're gonna go back to the fight. Cracking some heads. Crack some heads. Oh, cool. Tough skin. Now, as far as like the uh, the trophies that I've earned and whatnot, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually uh, make a, vi a little video about that, and kind of walk you through like what's going on with that if you don't know already. Uh, I got lucky right here. One hit and he went down. He was holding the gun, so. Got all that. Grab the map. And now, go up here. And, yeah, this, this is like just been like just a really fun series for me to put together. And I'm, I've been happy to do it. I mean, like I said, it's Zombie oh, oh, Nazi dogs, no! Die, zombie dog. Zombie Nazi dog, die. Um, anyway. Anyway, folks. Uh, I am getting close to the end of the video. I do want to thank you once again for watching. You guys have a great night and an even better tomorrow. Tom an even better tomorrow. You guys have. Oh boy. Anyway, I'm tongue tied. Good night, folks.